I can probably guess what your favorite search engine is. Like everyone else, it's most probably Google, am I right? Guys, there's one thing you didn't know about Google. Aside from being the world's most favorite search engine, you can also earn money from it. Yes, you heard me right. We will be making money online using Google today. Wanna know how? Well, you've come to the right place. Welcome to the Next Level Investors YouTube channel. In this video, we'll teach you tips and tricks to help you make money online. Feel free to subscribe to this channel and hit that notification bell so you'll be updated whenever we upload a new video. Please like this video and leave a comment down below. Now let's get back to the video. I know you're probably wondering how much you can earn from this method. I would be more than happy to tell you that you can make up to $500 daily. This method is absolutely free and there are no hidden fees whatsoever. It is also available worldwide, which means that no matter where you're from, this method will work for you. $500 may not seem like a lot to most of you, but it's definitely a good amount considering you won't do much work and you won't have to spend a single cent. I suggest you don't skip any part of this video because you might miss out on important details and end up not earning anything at all. That would be a complete waste of your time and effort. Now we definitely don't want that happening. So make sure you stay with us until the end of this video Patience is key, my friends. Now this method isn't as simple as you think. It's pretty easy to do, but it's only easy if you understand the instructions well, so listen carefully. Now I want you to head over to this website here. Just type in montereypizzacafe.com.au This website is of a pizza cafe. You can order different flavors of pizza here. They have wraps and salads and they offer catering as well. Now I want you to focus on this section right here. On your browser's address bar, you can see that it says not secure on the left side. That means that your connection to the site isn't secure. A pop-up warns you not to enter any sensitive information to the site, like passwords, credit card information, and security numbers. This is because your information might get stolen or leaked. Now websites like this are marked unsafe because sometimes people call using the numbers provided on the site and sometimes they're asked to give out credit card information via call, which is obviously not a safe way of relaying information. I'm not saying that this website isn't safe, but sites like this are not secured by an SSL certificate. SSL certificates are important because they protect server-client communication. Once an SSL has been installed, every single bit of information is now encrypted and locked. Access is only given to the intended server or browser. That is why websites with SSL certificates make users feel more comfortable and secure to enter sensitive information. No user would feel like their information is safe after being told that the website they're visiting is not secure or unsafe. Harmful websites exist and they're abundant nowadays. They can hack your IP address, and from there, they can get access to your location, so be very careful and selective with the websites you use. Another example of a website that is not secure and has no SSL certificate is wikidot.com. This website is a publishing network that offers everybody a place on the internet. They allow you to create your own websites, of course, with their domain. It allows you to create websites you can fully customize. You can edit content, upload files, communicate, and collaborate. There are still so many sites that don't have an SSL certificate, like myshopify.com, babytree.com, and so many more. Now let me show you an example of a site that is actually secure. Head over to metmuseum.org. As you can see beside the URL, there is actually a padlock icon. Once you click on that, a pop-up menu will tell you that your connection is secure. This means that all your information is encrypted. Your passwords and credit card information will be sent securely. If you want to apply for an SSL certificate, you can look it up on Google or YouTube and there will probably be some videos about how to apply for a certificate. Now if you don't want to do that yourself, I've got a solution for you. I will be sharing with you how you can make money off this method. You can get clients from around the world and earn a lot of money online. 
I know you are all excited and I'm just as excited to start sharing this with you. Today, we will be applying for SSL certificates on the behalf of these websites or business owners who don't have one yet. Stick with us until the end of this video because somewhere in the video, we will be sharing a tip on how you can get this to run on autopilot without having to do anything. Now, if you go onto YouTube and look up the steps on how to obtain an SSL certificate, you will find a lot of videos and tutorials that are very short, around less than 5 minutes long. I'm pretty sure you can do this yourself, if you just want to earn money passively. But in order to begin helping those around the world and help them with their company, just jump over to Fiverr.com and look up SSL certificates. As you can see, there are a ton of freelancers over here that actually offer the service of helping companies obtain a certificate for their websites. They're charging $20 to $50 for this. All these rates vary because the certificates are different individually. There are actually different types of SSL certificates. So the amount you charge your future clients actually depends on the type of certificates their websites need. And you can also give them an estimate of how long you think it'll take. So many people are earning money through this method and in the future you will be one of them. Look at this guy. He's earning so much off this type of service. This actually means that this freelancer is trusted, has a good reputation in the Fiverr community, and has worked with so many clients. This freelancer is charging people around $10 to $20, promising to fix or install an SSL for them. What I suggest you can do is contact different people that are offering this service and tell them that you can potentially drive a lot of traffic to their campaigns and offers. Ask them their best prices for a 12-month certificate. Look for those recognized or trusted freelancers who seem to have had experience with many clients. You can find clients and charge them $50 and then get the SSL done by a freelancer who charges way less. You will definitely make a profit out of this. Just make sure to charge more than how much it will actually cost you to get it done by someone else. Now let's go back to the pizza website from earlier. As you can see, they have provided some contact information. You can look for contact information on a site by scrolling further down. Usually, their contact information can be found at the bottom of the page. Reach out to their Facebook account or just call their number and offer them your SSL certificate services. Now here's a bonus tip. When reaching out to clients, you can actually prepare a script so that you don't have to think of what to say each time. Brainstorm on ways on how to reach out to companies in a polite and professional manner. Talk about the importance of having an SSL certificate the benefits, disadvantages, and possible consequences they might face in the future. Basically, just focus on how the absence of a certificate may possibly affect their business negatively and significantly in the future. Type all of this in one document. Tell them that you work with a team that is professionally experienced when it comes to websites and these certificate issues, and tell them to send you a message once they decide to avail of your services. You can actually automate your email responses by visiting this website called rebump.cc. This website actually allows you to create an email sequence that not only sends out automated responses, but actually follows up with the companies that you have emailed. The more you follow up, the higher the probability of them responding. After sending the initial email, which is basically what we wrote in the document earlier, they will send a second, third, and fourth email to follow up with your offers. This will help improve your response rate. You can use this website for $5 a month, and you can also upgrade to the Unlimited Plus account for $12 a month. That is actually a very cheap price to pay for the high quality services that they offer. So we've talked you through every step, given you the tips, and included some helpful tools. I'm sure you will be making money in no time. And that's it for today's video. If you stay this long, consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell. Please like this video, leave a comment down below, and we'll see you in the next video.